and welcome back to our YouTube channel. And if you are not subscribed pa sa ating channel, like, share, and subscribe. At pakipindot na rin ang notification bell para sa ating series ng Trouble Vlog. Okay, perfect. And we are now here in Sunshine City, Kibukuro, Toshima, Japan. And syempre, binabagtas na natin ito papunta doon sa loob ng Sunshine City. And nandito na pala tayo sa Sunshine City. And syempre, dito po sa Sunshine City is ang pinakamalaking building sa Ikibukuro na talaga namang makikita niyo at matatagpuan ninyo ang mga kainan, shopping center na pwede ninyong isama ang inyong mga anak, boyfriend, mother, father, sister, tita, lola at pwede ninyong isama sa loob ng Sunshine City. And guess what? Bakit po nasabi ko po ito? Dahil dito po sa Sunshine City, isa po siyang pinakamataas na building dito sa Ikibukuro, Tokyo, Japan. And syempre, uh, bibigyan ko po kayo ng ibig sabihin ng Sunshine City dito sa Ikebukuro. Okay, Sunshine City is a building complex located in East Ikibukuro, Toshima, Tokyo, Japan. It has 240 meters tall, sunshine 60 sky craper at its center. Sunshine City consists of four buildings. Sunshine City, 60, the main and tallest building which is includes corporate offices as well as restaurant, the Friends Hotel, the World Import Mart, and the Bunkakai Khan Building. The lower floors of the complex cater towards passerby and customer with a large shopping mall and numerous restaurants, while the higher floors tend to include corporate offices and hotel rooms. The complex, which was opened in 1978, contains numerous attractions including an observatory deck located at the top of Sunshine 60 called Sky Circus, the Ancient Orient Museum, an aquarium, a planetarium, the Friends Hotel, a non run indoor amusement park, a convention center, and a theater. When it was opened, Sunshine 60 Office Tower Block was reputed to be a tallest building in Asia. It is early example of city within a city. A self-contained area with a place to live, work, and shop within one area. Since Sunshine 60's Sky Circus Observatory was opened, other observation deck was opened in Tokyo such as at Roppongi and the Tokyo Government Offices. Perfect. O, oh, diba? Ang taray dito sa Sunshine City dahil dito nyo lang po matatagpuan ang kung ano-ano pong mga pwede ninyong pasyalan. Diba? Nasabi nga dito na meron ditong aquarium, planetarium, museum, and syempre may circus din sa loob ng ito. So, pupuntahan natin today is yung tinatawag nating Sky Circus. So, bakikita ito ng mga bata, lalo-lalo na yung mga bata gustong gusto nila na yung mga sky circus na katulad nito. So, aakit na tayo sa taas at intay nyo lamang po yung mga susunod nating mangyayari. Pagdating ng takdang panahon para tayo ay umakyat na dito sa, sa observatory deck. Okay guys, nakabili na tayo ng ticket at pumasok na tayo dito sa Sky Circus Sunshine 60. Then, syempre makikita natin dito ang mataas na building. And dito po sa Sky Circus makikita nyo rin po yung mga talagang pambata or talagang pang romantic na place to be. O, oh, ba? So, tingnan nyo po yung mga nasa paligid ko. Siyempre, may mga channeling-channeling na ganyan. Pero, as in, nakakatuwa po siya pag nakita mo siya sa personal. At, ito po ang masasabi ko lamang about the Sky Circus. Located on the 60th top floor of Ikibukuro Sunshine City. This observatory is one of the better places for gazing out over our beautiful city. It has been newly divided into separate areas. Each one featuring a different suiting soundtrack by artist Shinya Kiyokawa. Interestingly, you can also take a look at the latest virtual reality technology here. 
try on head mounted display the experience Tokyo Danga Flight, a magical journey traveling 251 meters above and futuristic version of Tokyo. So, makikita nyo po ito sa Sunshine 60 Building, 60. Floor three das one Higashi Kibukuro Toshimaku Tokyo. Okay, pinakamadaling transportation Higashi Kibukuro Station to Yarakakuchi Line Exit Six or Seven Ikibukuro Station East Exit. So, ang price dito ay one thousand two hundred yen sa university and the high school student, junior high school and primary school student six hundred yen. Children age for four and older, three hundred yen. Yan ang perfect sa mga pagpunta nyo dito sa Sky Circus Sunshine Sixty Observatory. Okay, perfect dito kaya kung kayo ay may mga anak dito sa Japan, pwede niyo silang isama dito para naman mag-enjoy po sila. Para din po ito sa mga bata. And hindi lang po bata ang nakikita ko sa loob ng Sky Circus. Kundi rin ang mga magjijowa at saka yung mga family talaga na nagbabonding around Ikebukuro. Perfect na perfect yan. In addition to this, syempre may mga concept po ang Sky Circus Ikebukuro. So, ship from view only type of platform to one which you can interact with that's what sky circus is all about what happen if you blend in excitement to view from the height up 251 meter your very soul will be released as all of your sense get stimulated from your watching touching feeling and marveling at the completely new sky born here after you experience this sky your whole perception will change Please enjoy your time with your own body and senses to your heart content. O, di ba? So, that is their concept sa kanilang mga customers. Enjoy 360 degrees panoramic views from height 351 meters above sea over the Shinjuku High Rise Building. Mount Fuji, Tokyo Sky Tree, and much more. Siyempre, pag nakita nyo sila doon sa labas ng, uh, mismo sa labas, makikita nyo talaga yung matataas na building sa Sky Circus. To stimulate the sense. Okay, perfect. Yan, ibig sabihin ng stimulate and the sense. Ano ba yung makikita natin sa loob? Number one is the Sky Trampoline, Infinite Scape, Kaleidoscope 60, a Sobrella Next, Mosaic Sky, and Sky Party. Siyempre, marami pa po kayong makikita sa loob ng Sky Circus na ito. Na talaga naman, di ba sabi ko sa inyo na magugustuhan ito ng kahit na sino tao sa Earth. And I hope you enjoy this vlog for today. At kung hindi ka pa nakasubscribe sa channel ko, like, share, and subscribe. At pakipindot na rin notification bell para sa ating series ng ating travel vlog. And see you on my next vlog. Bye!